I'ma say, boy, stay away from that weed. She thinking this weed is killing me. Maintaining my prayer when I pray, and God, my gloss ain't me for my enemy. What's up with it, YouTube, man? Welcome back to Life of Corn, man. I know I ain't dropped in so long. I've been, hey, I've been getting at it. Got a new job, working in Texas now. I'm gone for two weeks, home a week, and yeah, it's been a lot been going on. A couple weeks, couple months. Nah, it's been like a month. A month or two. But it's been a lot been going on. It's been a month and a half. Appreciate my boy Tay. Yeah, Tay up this bitch too. Look at him. What's up? <laughs> nah, we've been getting at it, man. Chasing the bag. But, man, I've been up here and it been eating me up inside that I ain't recorded. So, hey, I'm just gonna give y'all something while I'm not at home. Because I've been wanting to do this video for a long time. By the thumbnail, y'all see I'm doing a story time. My first time getting high. Y'all stay to the end of this video. I promise you're gonna get a good laugh. But first, y'all already know, please hit that like, come subscribe button. Let's get to it. All right, now let's get to it, man. I know the background and everything look ugly and nasty, man, but we in a man count, man. This is how the oil feel is, and this shit is nasty and yeah, so. Dirty. It's dirty, it's all that, but we ain't gonna get into all that because we ain't gonna speak on that. This ain't no hard work. But yeah, all right, yeah. so, my first time getting high, bro. I'm gonna let y'all know, man. My mom and my daddy don't, none of my family members don't know nothing about this. So if y'all see this, I'm sorry, but I'm grown now. I'm 22 years old, so I can let it out now. You can't do nothing to me now. You can't whoop me, you can't get mad, you can't do none of that. So my first time getting high, I think I was in like eight, eight, eight or ninth grade. I was in eight or ninth grade. Then it was my birthday. I, was turn, I can't remember how old I was turning, but I always said I want to get high. I want to get high for my birthday. So I, I went to my two, two of my homeboy. I ain't going to say their name. I ain't going to put their names out here because later on in the video, y'all going to be like, damn, hey, that's fucked up and all that shit. But I ain't going to put the names in the video, but I would these my, my two. two <laughs> Look, he said it's like it's funny. But <laughs> anyway, I would these, my two homeboys and everything. So we were going somewhere. I told them what I wanted to do. Cause one of the homeboy, he one of the homeboy, he didn't smoke at the time. He was a football player. He was like, he he was trying to go to the NFL. He wasn't doing none of that. And the other one, he was smoking and all that shit. But anyways, so I let them know and everything. So they were like, all right, babe, we'll get you high for your birthday. All right, boom. So first we they come pick me up from my mama house and we riding and stuff. And they kept him out. You sure you want to do what you want to do? I'm like, hey, yeah, hey, I want to try. I want to try to see what it's like. Everybody, want, everybody, y'all know the trend. Y'all seen everybody doing it, so y'all want to try it too. So that's what I was on. So I wanted to try it. So, um, all right, we get there. They come pick me up. So we riding and stuff. We riding in the city. We went to the city and everything. So, all right, we had pulled up at this girl house. We had put up this girl house. And my homeboy, he like he was going to smoke with her and everything. So he was like, we're going to go over her house and smoke. So we pulled up. I knew the girl from uh, high school. We was in class and everything. So she was cool people. She was real cool people. So um, we had pulled up and everything, got out, met her mama and all that, her mama there and all that. So we went to the room. We went to the room. We were just chilling in the bed and everything. They, the blunt was already rolled up. It was already rolled up. So I wasn't thinking nothing of it. Like now, try that with me. I'll yeah, do something to you. No. <laughs> I don't even smoke, right? I don't smoke now. I don't do none of that. So we get the, like I said, we was in the room just chilling. The blunt already rolled up, so they they fired up. So it was the girl was on the bed. The girl was on the bed. I was like on the edge of the bed, and my other homeboy that smoked, he was like in, like no, he was standing up, and the one that the one that didn't uh smoke, he was just sitting down, just laughing and shit. So all right, they lit it up. They passing around and everything. So I get it. I hit. I hit it, passed it. He hit it, he hit it, passed it. We was just talking, we were talking and everything. And I, it finally get back to me. So I hit it. I said, man, I ain't feeling nothing. And then I said, you got to hit it. got to hit it like two times. So I I hit it. Then that second time, I swear to God, I hit it and I ghost. If you don't know what ghost it is, it's like when you when you smoke, you let the, some smoke come out, you suck it back in. So that's what I did. I ghosted and I swear, I swear this on my life. That's on Rico. When I ghosted, the only thing I remember really, when I passed it, when it got out of my hand, it's like, I instant, it hit me. I blacked, it felt like I blacked out. Like, man, I was just, bro, this, the feeling, I don't know, the feeling like I was dying. I'm going to say, it felt like I was dying. So I'm gonna, like, I, when I passed it, so I blacked out. So boom, 
I'm blacked out and I'm like, I'm looking around and everything. And then my homeboy that smoked, he was like, come wrong. I said, man, I don't feel it, I feel it. So he thought it was funny and everything. Yeah, my other homeboy that didn't smoke, he was just chilling there on his phone. And yeah, the girl like, Quan, you straight? I like, nah. Then um, they try to pass it back to him. I said, nah, I don't want it no more. So I'm leaning and everything. Then motherfucking, I feel my heart beat. I'm talking about nigga. I'm talking about my, I feel my, I feel like my, my, I'm, my heart beating so hard. It's like it's gonna explode. I feel like my heart was finna explode. I kept telling them, I said, I'm finna die. Oh, they thought that was funny. I'm finna die. I'm telling them I'm finna die. I'm I feel like I'm falling. Heart beating. I feel like my heart finna explode. So, man, I said, I'm, man, I'm finna die. I'm finna die. They're like, Quan, you tripping? Chill out. I said, no, I'm about to die. And my other homeboy that didn't, uh, didn't uh, laugh, I mean, didn't smoke, he was laughing. And that made me mad. I was like, you keep laughing, that's on my mom. I'm gonna beat the shit out. Don't tell me, I was mad. I was ready to fight. Cause they thought it was so funny, but I'm telling these niggas I'm finna die. So when it, when I started saying that, they get they were like, "Ooh, we need him. He, he for real." So they they try to come try to calm me down and everything. Man, nigga, I swear to God, nigga, I'm praying. I'm praying. I remember praying. I'm saying, God, please take it away. Please take it away. I'm finna die. I don't want to die. That's all I was saying. And they were like, they thought it was funny. And the girl. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, bro, listen, I told the girl, I looked at that girl, I said, let me fuck before I die. <laughs> I, to, I swear to, I swear, y'all, I told her that exactly, that's exactly came out of my mouth. I told her that, and my homeboy that once more, he was like, man, yo, we need to get on, get up out of here. We need to go. So they, we, they finally get me up and everything. So when they open the door and the sun hit me, I was like, I snapped back in. So I feel like, I said, all right, yeah, I'm getting good now. So we walking out to the truck. We get in the truck. We riding down. I'm feeling, I'm feeling, I'm, I'm feeling normal. I think I'm feeling normal. Like I ain't feeling how I was in that house. So we ride. All of a sudden I get the giggle box. I'm talking about, I'm laughing. I'm talking about, I am dying laughing for nothing. I'm talking about, man, tears. I'm talking about, I'm bawling tears. You know, you laugh so hard, your stomach just, yeah. I'm talking about, I was dying laughing. Then we were riding, it was a police in front of us. Oh, man, I thought we were finna go to jail. I'm on, all right, we finna go to jail. I'm talking about, I'm tripping. I'm thinking we finna, man, I don't know what was going on. At the time, that, I thought that was weak, but that was not, I don't give Spice. That was spice. That they spiced me. Like till to this day, I be telling his ass, I'd have beat your ass for spicing me. But he click lace, spice, whatever you want to call it. I be telling his ass that. But he claiming one nothing, but I ain't crazy. I know people that don't smoke real stuff, real spice and everything. Yeah, matter, and when I told them how I feel, they're like, yeah, they gave you that they gave you that shit. They gave you that shit. <laughs> <laughs> they gave you that shit. So hey. But yeah, I be telling I tell them that every time I see him. So but nah, so we riding. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, man, we finna die. We finna die. We finna die. I'm, we finna go to jail. We finna go to jail. We finna go to jail. And everything. So it cooled down and everything. And mind you, we were supposed to be going to pick up a dog. So we finally going to get this dog. And we got the dog on our truck and everything. I'm talking about, nigga, I get the munch out of nowhere. I, I'm hungry. I'm talking about, I don't, give, I don't care what you talking about. You got to give me some food now. So we went to McDonald's. I bought me a number seven. We well, on a ketchup and mayonnaise, which is two cheeseburger, medium fry, and a medium drink. And I got me some two cookies. I ate all my food. I'm like that. They still eating on their food. I done took their fries. They gave them their fries because I was getting mad. Gave them, they gave them both of their fries. So we riding. We finally get to my home, but how? No, nah, no, nah, I'm, I'm skipping apart. So we riding. Once I got my food and everything, I get, to get in my system and everything. We riding. We riding. Then, what happened? What happened? I had fell asleep. I don't know where I'm asleep. Then we on a back road called Bush Deer. If y'all familiar where I'm from, y'all know what I'm talking about. So the song, I came through, what it is? I came through swerving by NBA Youngboy. I was in my sleep, that song came on. I'm up, I am came through swerving. I'm talking about, I'm like that, I don't know where. They like, what's wrong, what's wrong? I'm like, I came through swerving. I'm talking about, I'm turned. They record me and everything. I'm turning. That's yeah. That's the only thing I heard in my head. Can't do. Swear I'm doing this. I'm Miller Rock. 
I'm doing it. The sun went off. I went right back to sleep. When the sun went out, I went right back to sleep. So we pulled back. We pulled up at uh, the one that don't smoke out. They got the dog out the truck and everything. So they was tied him up or something. And all I know, nigga, I'm throwing my guts up. That's my, I'm throwing up like crazy. So after I threw up, I went right back to sleep. So later on that day, he was like, it was like getting late. And my mama, my mama wasn't playing. I had to be at home at a certain time. So it was getting close for me to get home, but I was still, I was still on that level. They were like, man, we can't let him go home like this. So boom, yeah. They called my mama or something, told her that I was over to sleep or something and all that. So she was like, cool, just tell him come home whenever he wake up. So boom, then I started shaking back and everything. Then I got home. When I got home, I walked in the house, I was good and everything. I went straight to my room, I went to sleep. Next day I woke up, I told him I would never smoke weed in my life. I don't give a fuck what you talking about, what you say that is, how good it make you feel, none of that. I'm not putting no blunt to my, my mouth, no nothing. None of that, cause nah. Even though that wasn't a real weed, that fuck, that traumatized me. So now I don't give a fuck about smoking no weed. I don't give a fuck what you talking about. I'm not hitting no weed. I don't wanna smoke. Fuck that. I don't give a fuck. That shit had me fucked up. I ain't lying to you. But yeah, man, at the end of the day, bro, I know y'all going to be on my ass in the comments and everything. But yeah, I know I would lay spice or whatever you want to call it. I already know. Like I told y'all in the video, I tell them that every day I see them. I already beat your ass and give me that shit. But it's all good, though, because I'm straight. I'm normal and everything. But I just be thinking, what if that could have messed me up for life? But I keep my distance from that. I keep my distance from that. But it's all good, though, so... That what I want to tell y'all, man. Y'all hey, tap in and let us know what y'all want us to do next. Some epic shit finna drop now. I just, hey, listen, we gonna home this week, and I, I promise I'm coming back with a back to back video. It's gonna be this I'm one. On, this on one finna ass. drop. This one gonna drop pretty soon. I got a a a, nut, a, a blind date coming up. I got some I'm doing my granny. And I know y'all want to see me. I got some this coming, but. I promise y'all just stay tuned and everything. Yeah, I hope y'all like the video and everything. Hey, yo, thank y'all for letting me, helping me hit that thousand subscribe. I finally got it. We at a thousand, a thousand and fifty right now. Let's keep running it up. Give me two thousand. Go to two thousand now. Just hit that like, comment, subscribe button, share this video, and stay tuned.